Hi folks. So we're sitting down today with Sarah Johnson. Hi. And we're going to catch up with her a little bit since the last time we did an interview. But for those of you who did not watch the first interview, Sarah, what is your name? Sarah Johnson. What do you do? Um, I am an artist. Ooh, okay. She's also <laughs> got her art conveniently located at Des Moines New Age Shop, just so as you know. And she's also <laughs> going to be participating in the Metaphysical Art Exhibition this December, 7th and 8th, correct? Yes. Out at Adventureland Park in the Palace Theater mm -hmm. in the Des Moines New Age and Psychic Fair. So, all right, Sarah, so tell me why you do it. Why do you do it? Why do I do art? Um, um, honestly, uh, Art, well, it's therapeutic. I love it. It's the way I express myself and the way that I get, you know, what I'm thinking and feeling out in front of me and not stuck in my head or things like that. Um, I also just enjoy people's reactions to when you draw something pretty and they're like, look at what you made. I'm like, yeah, thank you. That's what right. I made. Exactly. <laughs> so. <laughs> what keeps you doing it? Um, oh, it's just, it's a part of me, honestly. I can't imagine not doing it. Uh, it's just second nature. Um, okay. Yeah, I just, it's what I do. <laughs> okay. So we're going to need some contact info from you because you do do commission work, yes, correct? I okay. do. Okay, all right. Mm -hmm. um, on Facebook, it's under Sarah with an H and then K A Y and then Johnson. So, okay. um, and I think it's probably the only one in Des Moines. So just okay. click for it that way. And email can be under the letter X and then Sarah X. K X at uh, gmail.com. Okay. So you were into the pirate treasure map phase when you did the email? Yes. Okay. No, it's that and uh, music. It has okay. to, it's a music reference as well. I know it gets, people think it's confusing, but no, it's actually, it has a lot to do with uh, the music that I make too. All right. Well, so. awesome. And what kind of music is that? Um, that would be, it's called hardcore and okay. it's just like, it's a lot of screaming and kicking oh, wow. and stuff okay. and I enjoy it. But, uh, and I have other emails as well, but that's what I use for my art. And they say Virgos are all gentle people. <laughs> okay, all right. So, let's catch up. What have you been doing lately? Um, I am, well, actually at this moment working on a project for, um, the organization's called Please Pass the Love. Okay. And the um, project is uh, the Brain Matters Project, I believe is what it's called. Anyway, I have a giant ceramic brain. It's about this okay, big. Okay, I was going to say, is this a zombie theme? No, it's no. Okay. It's a, I, I think it's in partnership. I picked up my brain from the VA, so I think it's okay. it's having to do with mental health, health awareness and um, just kind of bringing those things to light. And so, like, I'm going to focus on, you know, my, because I deal with PTSD. And so oh, I'm going yeah. to focus my brain on kind of a, representing that and how that looks for me. That's awesome. So, okay, yeah. yeah. No, and there actually have been studies, brain scans with people with PTSD and how it changes and affects and all that fun stuff. Oh, yeah, it does. It's I study all okay, that stuff. Not, Super interesting. It's yeah. not fun, but, yeah. you know. No, no, that's, yeah, and I knew really what you meant. Like, I do the same thing. Like, that's super neat. And they're like, that's really, like, dark. I'm like, but it's cool. So, yeah, yeah, okay. But yeah, no. interesting. <laughs> this is the bad part of be by being slightly nerdy. We find everything interesting, and we're curious about everything. And the problem is, people are like, whoa. And then they're like, hey. <laughs> and we're like, we promise we're not serial killers or anything. For educational purposes. Yeah. Okay, some of the time. Some of the time. Unless somebody really makes well, you angry. You well, know, yeah. Then I it's mean, just like, yeah. Got yeah, it. Right. Right. Yeah. <laughs> so, do you know what the best way to dispose of a body is, Sarah? No, I'm kidding. Mm. <laughs> Actually, I saw a good one. It's like you call the cops, tell them where to look for the body so it's already dug up. Then you put the body in there and they never look for it again because they already look there. <gasps> that is genius. Right? Anyway, moving on. <laughs> to the crime documentary. Right? <laughs> so, what else are you doing? What has been going on with you in the art scene and what do you feel like you're expressing right now? Um, I'm still kind of a little under the radar in okay. it at the moment, working my way slowly back into it. Okay. Um. You know, I've been kind of paying attention to what everybody else is doing in a lot right. of shows and things. Um, but I've been honestly just focusing on kind of my own little body of work at the moment and kind of processing through some things and just uh, eventually going to probably bring that out and show at some point soon. But it's Definitely. just kind of... You should have an art show here. I should. Yes, with wine and cheese. Agreed. Wait, I don't have the insurance for wine. Grape juice and cheese. There you go. Grape juice and cheese. <laughs> so, okay, that works. Right. So... 
anything you want to bring awareness to? Anything, any message you would want to give people out there? Um, trying to think. Um, Speak your truth. What is on your heart? <laughs> you never get a chance to do this. Come I know. On. I'm terrible at that. Um, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Some throat chakra oil. <laughs> it's so yeah. Project. Um, no, I guess like and for right now at this moment, the way the things that I'm focusing on and the things that I'm just kind of noticing with the people around me and kind of society at large right now is like I'm focusing on healing and trying to like kind of center back and focus on like the people closest to me and around me and that you know are the most important to me because I feel like. Things have been very spread out and chaotic lately. And so, to me, that's what I'm kind of pursuing at the moment is... So, take care of people around you. Take yes. care of your loved ones. Mm -hmm. Take care of yourself. Yep. Don't be so mean and hateful. Yeah. You know, like, Let's go with that one. Like, like, no more hate. Stop all hate. <laughs> no hating. Besides, it's Christmas for the love of God. Okay. I know. Right. Christmas is like my season. I, I kind of like, I like Krampus a lot, though, so... Oh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> he does hate people. He's like, ah. Do you deserve it? True. Okay. Yeah. You have to earn it. Yeah, true. Mm -hmm. True. All right, Gerb. Well, thank you for coming in and sitting down with us today. I really appreciate you coming out. Uh -huh. Always a pleasure to interview you. It's always fun. And ta-da! <laughs>